Hi everyone! Nowadays most of us are spending our time at home and I think it is right time to learn some words and improve our vocabulary. That's why I am here and I will help you improve your vocabulary. So I have decided to share your daily videos and explain some words to improve your vocabulary. So these words are advanced words and in these videos I will give you explanations, definitions, example sentences and of course I will also show some synonyms. So you can learn these words, daily improve your vocabulary and of course you can use these words in the speaking and writing modules of the IELTS exam. So let's get started. The first word is abrupt. Abrupt is an adjective and it is an advanced word. We can use abrupt when we talk about sudden changes. If something changes immediately, in this case you can use this word. Abrupt is an adjective, but of course we can use it as an adverb and in this case we will say abruptly. So if you talk about something that changes suddenly, immediately, then of course you can use this word. The synonyms for this word are sudden, unexpected, immediate and so on. Let's look at examples. For example, you can tell, excuse me for my abrupt question. Or you can tell, I was surprised by the abrupt ending to the conversation. The next one is acclaim. Acclaim. It is a verb and it means to strongly praise someone or applaud someone. But we can also use this word as a noun. In this case, it means a public approval or public praise. So we can use it as a verb and as a noun. In this case, the synonyms can be, for example, praise or approve as a verb, but approval as a noun. Or we can also say compliment or to upload and so on. Let's look at examples. She is being acclaimed as the greatest dancer of her generation. She was widely acclaimed for her contribution to the discovery. The next word is autonomous. Autonomous is an adjective and it means being independent or having the power to make your own decision. We can say an autonomous country or an autonomous organization or an autonomous region to show that it is independent and it can make its own decisions. Most students understand independent as its synonym. Actually, somehow they have similar meanings. But it is better to use self-governing as the best synonym for this word, I mean for autonomous. Let's look at examples. Teachers aim to help children become autonomous learners. The country is divided into 17 autonomous regions. What about disruptive? Disruptive is an adjective and we use this word when we describe the situation that causes trouble or problem or difficulties. And of course, all these difficulties interrupt all your plans. Synonyms for this word are distressing or troublesome. For example, night work can be very disruptive to home life. His teacher described him as a noisy, disruptive influence in class. Persistent. So it is pronounced as persistent. Persistent is an adjective and we use this word when we talk about difficulty that lasts very long and you want to get rid of the situation. Or if you say that I am persistent, it means you continue doing everything in order to get rid of this difficulty or you do everything in order to achieve what you want. So if you are persistent, it means you are determined. The synonyms for this word are determined or insistent. Let's look at examples. She can be very persistent when she wants something 
Be persistent. Don't give up. The next one is Advent. Advent is a noun and we use this word. Then we talk about the arrival of a notable person or notable idea or thing or event. If you say the advent of something, it means the introduction of new product or new item or new idea or new custom. The synonyms for these words are happening or occurrence or arrival. Let's look at examples. Before the advent of computers, not many people knew how to type. People are much better informed since the advent of the computer. The next one is agile. Agile is an adjective and we use this word when you describe someone who is very active or dynamic or energetic. In this case, it means this person is very nimble and moves or does everything very quickly and easily. Of course, the synonyms are quick or nimble or moving easily and so on. Let's look at examples. Monkeys are very agile climbers. You need to have agile fingers to do this kind of work. The next one is appealing. Appealing, actually, I love this word very much. And if you say appealing, it means something attractive or interesting. If you say that something is appealing to me, it means you like doing that thing or you love doing that thing. Synonyms for these words are attractive, interesting, alluring and so on. It is an adjective and of course it is an advanced word. In both speaking and writing module, of course you can use this word. Let's look at examples. He had a nice smile and an appealing personality. Working abroad is appealing to many people. The next one is celebrated. So celebrated is an adjective. And if we say that a celebrated person, it means a famous person. So it means being famous or being well known. The synonyms for these word, of course, are famous, well known, prominent and so on. Celebrated is an adjective, but as a noun we say celebrity. It is pronounced as celebrity. Let's look at examples. The garden became celebrated for its plants. The city is celebrated for its beautiful scenery. The last word is contemporary. Contemporary is an adjective and it means existing or happening now. For example, we can say contemporary art or contemporary dance or contemporary music. So it means it is related to present time. It is modern. The synonyms for these words are modern or present day or up to date. For example, the museum contains 6,000 contemporary and modern artworks. His work is contemporary. So we have learned today 10 new words. These words are abrupt, acclaim, autonomous, disruptive, persistent, advent, agile, appealing, celebrated and contemporary. Try to make your own sentences with these words in order to learn better. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a nice day.